Let's start with Taurus, 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 Taurus. This is your reading for the a week of May 31st to June 6th. Um, not everything I say is for you, but um, I try to give you the best advice uh, with whatever you got going on, just to highlight whatever might be uh, major, important happening this week. Temperance, lovers, um, you could be deciding to chase love, you could be deciding to introduce love in your life, you could be deciding to, um, how would I put it, bring balance in your life in terms of love. Uh, it could be um, somebody you really have a, a crush on, it could be somebody who's close to you, it could be somebody, a friend, a family. But uh, you're balancing uh, the, the desire for love with uh, balancing with life and love, basically. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Let's get into your weekly reading. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, um, I've been feeling off, so I got these candles. I don't know why, it's just, I know it's like, it's a candle, but I don't know, I think it's a stable flame that burns, that just keeps me feeling steady, stable. Cause it's just a fire burning it sits there you know and burns and just burns and burns you touch it it burns you you live it you live it it shines a light on you anyway let's get into your reading There is this energy of Ten of Cups that's just going around. Uh, Aquarius had it. Um, Pisces too. Um, yeah, there's this energy of just um, family happiness just going around. It's not like... Um, it's, it's not like uh, it doesn't have to be family. It's some sort of union. Let's come together. Let's, uh, you know, be happy. You know, that, that come together energy is around you. Um, if you're a family uh, member, family in a family situation, either father figure, uh, it could be like you're stepping in your power a bit more. You know, things are just... It just seems like somebody who's taking control of their life, you know, uh, control of the aspects that's happening. Um, you know, somebody who's showing up when they're needed. Well, I get the with the with the ten of cups. I get the king of cups. This is why I was saying a father figure, uh, somebody who's a provider, somebody who's stable, steady. Uh, this could be you who's stepping into this power of uh, I feel happy, I feel happy with myself. Uh, I can provide for myself, I can provide for people around me. Uh, you know, I have a cup to offer. And uh, I think that's where um, this uh, happiness just comes from. You just feel like you owe, you have value, you owe value. What you've been doing really has value, you know. Temperance, temperance, balance. There's this huge demand for balance that's just showing up in your life. And the six of uh, six of our coins, six of pentacles. 
in reverse over generosity uh take care not to give too much yes that could be a thing um yes you might be in this position of yes i'm a provider yes i'm feeling happy and that could result into you giving a bit too much than you can um handle you know um the, if you have Pisces in your charts, you might want to uh, read. The, you want, might want to uh, go see the Pisces reading because they kind of have the same thing. It's it's um. I know Pisces they're commonly like people pleasers, but when it comes to the Ten of Cups where you feel the joy, yes, there is gonna be that. Oh man, I just feel like blossoming, just sharing this energy with everybody. Or if somebody you meet somebody who needs your energy, just feel like yeah, sure, you know. Um. There might be a, a desire for you to balance uh, what you give off and what you keep to yourself, you know. Uh, with Six of Cups in reverse and the King of Cups. No, Six, six of Pentacles and the King of Cups. Yeah, you might want to balance what you have, what you keep for yourself and what you, uh, you give off. Three of Wands. Uh, yeah, deciding... Um, no, no, no. You... Excuse me. I'm getting a bit ahead of myself. After the after the Ten of Cups, you get the Five of Swords. Um, sorry, yeah, you had the Ten of Cups, Five of Swords, and the Six of Cups. Um, just energy of um, happy family. Let's come together, cause we just been through some shit. Five of Swords, you know, victory. Uh, we just been through some heavy energy, so you know we just been through some crap, and uh, you just—I feel like you're just coming out of something. You're just coming out of a situation. You're just coming out of uh, a rough patch of time. You know, the really, really, the really, um, really was heavy on you. And what I'm here to tell you is like. You might have had to stand for yourself and fight, but right now it's like you have all the cards, you know. In the future, you might you might get in your head that's common because life goes up and down. But you know, this five of swords, this current energy right now, it's like a, I'm calm. I feel victory. I feel happy. You know, there is that victory around you. There is that um, embodiment of. Um, success and uh with the three of wands i see you uh a bit a bit wondering if what you've been through will be of any use to you i would say yes it's um what you you have your eye on what you're going forward with you will reap what you sow it's just like sometimes things take time to uh you know grow out but the decision you're making it feels like it's the right decision because um it will pay off a lot more than um a lot more than you think. It could be um, something you're choosing to invest in, a direction you're choosing to head in, uh, an idea, a belief that you, you're deciding to start believing in. Excuse me. Yeah, four pentacles. Uh, you might be deciding where to invest your money, where to, um, you know, what direction to to keep that happiness going yeah to just keep that happiness for a long time and um what i'm saying is that three of wands four pentacles or four of coins and the six of wands yeah there is this am i making the right decision should i be doing this and it's like yes why the four pentacles comes to tell me like you're setting up a foundation for yourself um if this is money related and you're wondering where where you should spend your money, where you should put your money, and you just have a bunch of options, I think you, the option you will choose is going to lead you to set up a foundation for yourself, for your future, for any coming scenario where your spending is not as much as, you know, I think you're being wise with your pentacle. That's what I'm getting for, for the four of uh, pentacles. And the six of souls is like... Um, you, you're ready. You're ready for this direction you chose in the Three of Wands. You're ready to head in that direction or you have an idea of where you want to head in. 
and uh, it's like you're rounding up your groups you're rounding up your if you're family friends the just like let's go Let, let's head in this direction you know there is this um, gathering up of people there is this uh, teamwork there is this let's head okay i'm heading to um better situations better life you with me you know that type of energy and um and uh, after that after this um six of wands just let me let me get more clarification on the six of wands before again the six of cups Six of Wands, um, the triumph return, recogni recognition for your accomplishment. That's what I'm saying. Where you're choosing to invest your money, where you're choosing to put your money, where you're choosing to save your money, I believe is paying off really, um, really insanely good. Um, with the Six of Cups, this is what I was about to tell you, the devil in reverse. You might be breaking toxic cycles, toxic relationships uh, things that were not fulfilling you things that are no longer of any use to you with the six of cups um, just really six of cups just says happiness you know childhood happiness you know when you're happy as a child like there is nothing but you it's just like hey you know I'm just I'm happy I'm happy with myself I'm happy to just be playful to play around I'm happy to just I'm happy with who I am. I think that's because you're breaking this devil uh, cycle, this um, chain that's been that has been holding you down, this um, not beneficial situation that you were just sitting in. Jesus Christ! Six of with the six of cups. I told you the devil in reverse, eight of wands, um, some sort of message, um, some sort of message news, some sort of um, something long. I feel like long awaited for, but you were like, fuck it, I might just go do my work and you know, not even pay attention to it. I see it coming through. I see something you might have your eye on for a good time. Just come through. I just don't think you're expecting it, but I see it come through. And it gives you this happiness. Remember Six of Cups, this childhood happiness? It comes with the strength. Strength card. Just it's happiness that's, I would say, doubled happiness. Because it's something you really desired, something you were really hoping for to turn out, you know? And I guess I'm this strength card I would say it pulled out these two candles, but what the fuck would I be saying, you know? But I just if if this is that strong, if this thing you really want is really that much dearly you want it so bad, I see you come in your life and just It's really gonna make you happy, that's all I can say. Uh, that's your Taurus reading. So yeah, thank you. <laughs>